attack is the global threats for the bloodless wars so india and other countries work together to find world shield to against of the this type of threats of cyber warfare hi good evening everyone the topic of today lecture i choose cyber warfare cyber warfare is a computer or networking based complex which involving mainly political motivated attacks nation states are using another states and nations for example cyber uh, sorry computer virus or uh, service attacks and mainly strategically military purpose can we see the how many countries are interested to develop this type of software as per reports of microsoft world wise accounting of this type of software russia 58% iran 11% kazakhstan 23% and when we see the how many countries are using this type of software for the other countries recently 2020 us exposed the warfare media is launching cyber attacks to targets of india russia kazakhstan malaysia etc and russia conducted misinformation boards for the elections of 2016 us recently the indian justice department also announced five military uh, chinese military software is try to threat for the us state we are listening in the news indian government also purchased pegasus software by using of thousand members of public figures to monitoring and spy their activities and we all know last few years india cancelled so many chinese apps because of the cyber attacks to security purpose also now we will discuss about how india often for this attacks in 2019 kalakulam nuclear power plant attacked by north korean for the administrative department and 2020 pakistan hackers also tried to for the government organizations to hack and 2020 chinese hackers also behind power outage of mumbai now we will discuss about way forward actually we should aware the nature of cyber threats and we can develop more technologies like artificial intelligence machine learning quantum uh, computing etc software to identify the threats before and india should be coordinate with the crt with other countries and india should be shift uh, cyber security to, sorry uh, information security to cyber security and india should be ready with crisis management to find solution immediately if any crisis is happen and india should be develop own cyber security for the indigenous solution for the cyber attacks before they attack attacking that's it thanks so much